Hey folks, this is Bardic Dragoon. Welcome to, welcome back to another uh, episode of Let's Play Mass Effect 3. When we last left off, we went to go deal with a Cerberus bomb planted uh, on Tuchanka, which it turned out was actually planted by Turians uh, during the Krogan Rebellions. And uh, yeah, the Turian group we were hoping to deal with the Cerberus bomb was kind of there more to cover up the uh, mistakes made by the Turians over anything else. Anyway, that being said, uh, it's really only one thing we can left to do here, so uh, let's get on to that and uh, see what, uh, yeah, we're going to get this uh, cure for the genophage dispersed at the Shroud facility here. Full stop. Hostiles detected at the landing coordinates. Joker, what have you got? Sensors show a Reaper parked at the Shroud facility. No way you're going to be able to land a shuttle there. Get everyone assembled in the war room. I want eyes on the Shroud. Aye, aye, ma'am. New form of Reaper, Shepard. Using Shroud to poison Tuchaka's atmosphere. Problematic. They want to fight! They just got one. Primarch, we're gonna need your help. That could be difficult. Our losses on Palavin have been catastrophic. We're doing this for Palavin. No one said it would be easy. What do you have in mind? A combined attack. Your people hit the Reaper with an airstrike. Rex, at the same time, your soldiers will be attacking from the ground. Together, you can draw it away from the tower. Yes, distraction. Small team can reach Shroud facility, finish synthesizing cure. We'll need Eve to come with us. And it's now or never. Now. The genophage ends today. Commander, incoming message marked urgent. I'll put it in the com room for you. Dalatras. Commander Shepard, we know you've reached Tuchanka. And by now, I imagine Morden Solus has proposed using the Shroud. Are you spying on us? Hardly. The Shroud is the only viable course of action open to you. Commander, you can't allow the diplomatic pressures of this war to cloud your judgment. Do you honestly believe curing the genophage will end in lasting peace? We have to give the Krogan that chance. You can't condemn an entire race to extinction based on what might happen. What will happen is the Krogan will reproduce out of control. We uplifted them specifically for their violent nature, not their diplomatic skills. Another war is inevitable. What do you want, Delatras? Years ago, our operatives sabotaged the Shroud facility to ensure what you're planning couldn't be done. Morden will likely detect this malfunction and repair it. But if you ensure that he doesn't, then the cure's viability will be altered just enough so that it fails. No one will notice the change. You mean trick the Krogan? They need not be any the wiser. Let Erdnot Rex believe you fulfilled your promise. Morden would never stand for that. How you deal with him is up to you, Commander. We can provide you our very best scientists to build the Crucible, and the full support of our fleets. If I sabotage the cure. Think about it, Commander. The choice is yours. Alright, so... This should be interesting. Anyway, standard uh, 2d5 here. 4 and 4, doubles. Alright. Oh, well, considering we're going to be going toe-to-toe -to -toe with a Reaper, I'm sure Javik wants to join up, would want to join in, so bring him along and go along with Javik. Yeah, it's going to be Reaper forces, definitely, so... Hmm. Don't really have to worry about shields too much. Armor might pop up occasionally. Uh... Actually, survivability is going to be useful. So, James. Alright, and... Just to make sure they're better thermal scope. 
high velocity barrel. But then we lose the ability to add a That's probably a better option. And... Yeah, that'll work. By the way, what do I have? Okay, I've got the same kind of thing here. Got that to counteract the weight of this bad boy. Quite sure why I gave that to you. That. There we go. And then let's see. High velocity barrel. Accuracy. Damage and piercing. That's piercing. Okay. Also leaves it looking kind of stupid, but you know, whatever. Alright. So, powers. Leveling up. Uh, I don't have enough points to do what I want to do. James. James, James, Jamie, James, James. Yeah, you know we're gonna kind of split you between incendiary ammo and fortification at this point, just because I don't know what else to do with you at this point. Got the important stuff help uh, maxed out. And as for you, devil pull with the A of effect could definitely be useful. And I think lift grenade is the next thing we should probably be focusing on. All right. I've ordered the clans to assemble at the Hollows. It's our sacred meeting ground. We'll land there and take an armored convoy against the Reaper. This will be the defining moment of Krogan history. Krogan history filled with defining moments, most bloody. Hope this one better. Commander, you seem troubled. I got a message from the... <sighs> Rex, it's Reeve. The Reapers are already at the Hollows. Come out with guns blazing. Hang on tight. We're heading in. <laughs> Shepard, keep them away from the female. I'll sort out what's happening with the other clans. <laughs> Everyone pick your targets and keep an eye on our six. Now move! All right. The enemy is approaching. Push forward. Don't let them get up here. songs about this someday. Reaper blood has finally soaked our soil. We have to get to the Shroud. The airstrike is on its way. Female safe, Shepard. Recommend haste, however. Vital signs troubling. 
What's a Solarian doing here? Nobody said anything about this. Multiple Krogan. Problematic. Who are you? Erdnot Reeve, brood brother to our... illustrious leader. <laughs> Reeve and I share the same mother, and nothing else. For which I'm thankful. I remember what it means to be a true Krogan. <laughs> we flay our enemies alive and drown them in a geyser of their own blood. We don't invite them into our home. There's no time for this. Whatever grudge you have against Salarians ends right now. As long as it involves a bullet in his head, time for some payback. <laughs> Stand down, Reeve. The Salarian is with me. <laughs> You can stay here and let old wounds fester as Krogan have always done. Or you can fight the enemy you were born to destroy and win a new future for our children. I choose to fight. Who will join me? I will. And so will I. Now hold your heads high like true Krogan. There's a Reaper that needs killing! <laughs> You'll have to placate them somehow. I'll demand the Council return some of our old territory. We'll need room to expand. Recapture the glory of the Ancients. Glory of Ancients led to Krogan rebellions, countless deaths, creation of Genophage. Expansion plan... problematic. What were the Ancient Krogan like? Tachanka wasn't always a wasteland. In the old times, the Krogan were a proud people. We had dreams. A future to look forward to. Until Salarian interference? No. We destroyed Tachunga ourselves. Technology changed us. It made life too easy. So we looked for new challenges and found them in each other. Nuclear war was inevitable. But now our planet is rubble. We'll need a better place to live. Any hint of the Krogan trying to expand again could raise alarms. My children aren't going to suffocate in this cesspool. I want them to witness a new age. A Krogan Empire. Rex. I'm not saying we won't ask first, but the Council can't expect us to stay here forever. Commander, on the shuttle, was there something you were going to say? The Dalatras tried to cut a secret deal with me. What kind of deal? She said they sabotaged the Shroud years ago. The cure won't work unless we fix it. Years ago, our operatives sabotaged the Shroud facility to ensure what you're planning couldn't be done. And she thought we wouldn't know better? Correctly. Would likely have fooled tests. But familiar with STG work, can adjust. Did not come this far for nothing. You just spared our race another genocide, Commander. I told you we could count on her. Why are we stopping? You and Morden stay with Eve. It's looking ugly out here. Will do. It's dangerous stopping like this. Look at that Reaper. It's Earth all over again. It would be my first kill, but not the last. And remember to break it. 
back when you're done. Yeah, sure, whatever. So, interesting little detail. The dude who came in there, uh, Erdnot Reeve, he's actually... Hey, we can't sit around like this. If you kill, if you end up killing Rex back on Vermeer, he becomes the leader of the Krogans. He's not a fun guy. What's the holdup? Roads out. The convoy can't make it through. Turian Wing Artemek, this is Shepard. We've been delayed. Hold off your attack. Negative Commander, our approach is locked. No return to the over here. An airstrike isn't enough against the Reaper. We must join the fight. I don't care if we have to build a new road. We are going. Why are you running up the hill backwards? Rex, are you receiving this? Is everyone okay? Yeah, just scratches. Nothing the Solarian can't patch up. Reeves truck made it out too. What the hell? The Turians had to call off the airstrike. We'll need a new plan for dealing with the Reaper. First we'll have to find you. Where did you end up? Underground. We see ruins of some kind. Commander. That's the city of the ancients. How do we get out? No maps exist. It's been abandoned for thousands of years. You're a trailblazer, Shepard. Get through there and we'll find a place to meet up. Nothing will stop this cure. Alright, so this is a fun little section of the game. To aimlessly wander through a dark tunnel with a limited cone of light to be able to see. They chose obedience as their subject. I'm sure this has some interesting things about their culture if you wanted to take time to think about it. Okay, that wasn't an earthquake. Rex, are you guys feeling these tremors? Not up here. It could be something else, Commander. It is said that Kalros, the mother of all Thresher Maws, lives in this region. Which is another reason to get your ass out of there, Shepard. Step on it. Kalros, the mother of all Thresher Maws. Sounds troubling. No kidding. If they gave the thing a name, it must be something special. Yeah. Kalros, I would guess. Impressive. That's what's crawling around down here. Well, I think that's a good reason good enough reason to get the heck out of here. Uh if I can figure out how. Oh, oh, that not that way. Uh, there we go. This is uh. I want to get. To, I want to see what those rhino things are that they're riding. Those look interesting. Uh oh. Looks like the Rachni again. There are bound to be more than just the ones we killed. Rex, we've got Rachni here. Keep an eye out. Ah, daylight, yes. Daylight ahead. Huh. Guess the Krogan didn't destroy everything. Remnants of a failed species. Yeah, could you be something besides a massive downer, dude? Like, seriously, what the hell? Rex, we made it back outside. Well, if you can see sunlight, that's progress. Check it out. 
guess the nukes didn't kill all the plants. You're looking at hope, all that's left of it on Tachanka. This is once a world full of beauty. Given a chance, it can be again. Shepard, that Reaper is still up to no good at the Shroud. Find a way out of there and we'll pick you up. We're on it. And when we get there, vengeance will be mine. Kind of a one-track mind there, huh, buddy? More Shit. opportunity for a kill. Oh. All right, Ravagers. This is fun. I didn't kill all of them. Let's try this again. I said, why are you not dead? Alright, now that the Ravagers are gone, I think. Yep, I'm staying sharp. I see. Oh, I thought that was a grenade. Darn it. As I just used the. Uh, James's grenade power was open. Hey, grenade! Heck yeah! But apparently that was just ammo. Which, I mean, ammo is not a bad thing to grab, but. It's not over yet! Of course it's not over. What the heck were you thinking it was over? You already said that, James, and he's dying. You're, you're, you're I've fallen a little behind there. And he isn't alone. Wait, what? There's another one? Okay. I said, charge! I said, there we go! Light enema! You guys suck. Move. Yeah, we've got some ideas on that. What? 
Not now, Rex. The commander has enough to worry about. What's happening? Some crazy idea we can talk about later. Just worry about getting out of there right now. Rex and crazy ideas involving a giant thresher moss scare me. <laughs> or is that just me? By the way, uh, there's a Ravager over there. Oh shit. <laughs> that everything? Other than little babies that are of no threat and apparently prevent the uh, game from considering the fight over unless I'm auto resing my uh, squad mates. Apparently not. Where the heck are you, James? That's Kalaros, that the, those fins or whatever seem to be bigger than most Thresher Maws. I can see this being a problem. I agree, James. I agree. Seems like they're having fun, but you know. Now where are we? A memorial of some kind. Heads up! Oh, shit, there's a Marauder. Okay. Hmm. I don't really have anything good for, uh, dealing with Marauders. Except bullets. Bullets do well against everything. Is that all of them? 
Uh, but yeah, as I mentioned before, marauders can be a bit problematic when there are husks in the area. They can add body armor to the husks. Doesn't add a armor uh, health rating to them, so you can still bioticize them and toss them around like ragdolls, but... Shepard, we've almost lost Kalros. Get down from there and we'll find you. But yeah, uh, it does make them harder to shoot, which I guess for the Pusk actually isn't that bad, but man, whatever. Shepard, get over here! Reeve, keep an eye out for that mall. I don't want it sneaking up on us. Make it quick, Rex. We're exposed. Move it! It's Kalra! Move, Shepard! We're in! Go! What about Reed? No way he survived that. And he was a pain in the ass, anyway. Now let's finish this. There's a Reaper waiting for us. Somebody has a plan B. Vengeance is the goal. Suicide is not. We're curing the genophage no matter what it takes. Everything my people will ever be depends on it. And I hope this idea you were talking about is a good one. It was hers, actually. Cal Ross. We summon her to the Reaper. Would that even work? Already discussed strategy. Just need to distract Reaper. Draw it from tower while cure synthesized. Released. What makes you so sure she'll come? Legends say <laughs> she is the mother from which all other Thresher Maws spawn. This is as much her home as ours. If Tuchanka has a temper, Kalros is it. Nobody's ever faced her and survived. We flew through the Omega-4 relay and survived. We can do this. That's the spirit, Shepard. How would we summon her? The tower was built in an arena devoted to Kalros's glory. The Salarians thought she would scare away intruders. Appears to have worked. There are two Maw Hammers there. <laughs> the largest in existence. If you can activate them, Kalros will come. That should distract the Reaper. Meanwhile, laboratory nearby. We'll finish synthesizing cure. Let's make sure we all get out of here alive. We're gonna have one hell of a story to tell. Wait! You've been a champion to the Krogan people, and an ally of Clan Erdnot. Thank you. Go! I've got this! I am Erdnot Rex, and this is my planet! See you on the other side. Stay alive, Shepard. We'll have Cure ready. So, oh, well, hit the ground running. All right, sure, let's do this. you could go over here. I mean, there's nothing over there, but I didn't realize you could go there. That's interesting. Reaper. 
Okay, so we're up to Plan D, I E. <laughs> All right. So here comes the. Yes, and somehow running underneath a reaper do is, doesn't take balls. James, James, my boy. All right. So yeah, this whole thing is insane. <laughs> Basically, watch out for big shadows like that. Because that means a reaper is about to step on you, and unsurprisingly, that is an instant KO. <laughs> Alright, let's see, what's the farthest I can target? No, come on. There we go, the one all the way in the back. Okay, that wasn't the one I thought I was targeting. Go! Get back to the truck! I'll take care of the cure! I love that cutscene. in two minutes, but E dead. What happened? Stress sampling, too intense, too much trauma. Wanted to stop, she refused. Her decision. She did it for her people. Female was stabilizing force for Krogan. Would have helped Rex rally more clans in support. Damn! Control room atop of Shroud Tower. Must take elevator up. You're going up there? Yes, manual access required. Have to counteract STG sabotage. Ensure cure dispersed properly. Morton, this whole thing is coming apart. There's got to be another way. Remote bypass impossible. STG countermeasures in place. No time to adjust cure for temperature variants. No, no other option. Not coming back. Suggest you get clear. Explosion likely to be problematic. You're sure you can do it? Of course. Why I came. Had to be me. Someone else might have gotten it wrong.
classic bypass. Standard fail safe. Excellent work. Yes, yes. Jennifer H. cured. Krogan free. New beginning. For all of us. faced our greatest enemy with rare valor. In death, she has proven a savior to her people. May her courage fan the flames of hope for the future. She is now the true mother of T'Changa. She was everything I want the Krogan to be. I hope we follow her example. She was one of the bravest souls I've ever met. But if she was here, I'm sure she'd say the same about you, Shepard. Everyone else has tried to rob us of our future. You gave us one that won't be forgotten. Too bad about Morden, though. He told me he had to do it. Someone else might have gotten it wrong. Well, he got this right for everyone. Tell the Primarch I'll be deploying troops to Palavan immediately. And when you're ready to kick the Reapers off Earth, you let me know. The Krogan are back in business. thing you just pulled off, Commander. Curing the Genophage? I never thought I'd see the day. Rex has agreed to help the Turians, Admiral. We should get their full support. I take it that leaves the Solarians out of the equation. The cost of their support was too high, sir. Well, I'll defer to your judgment on that, Commander. Let's hope we don't need them. Hackett, out. Commander, Erdnot Rex has begun sending troops to Palavan. You kept your end of the bargain, and now I'll keep mine. The Turian hierarchy will stand with humanity against the Reapers. I'm glad we can help each other out. It's the only way we're going to defeat the Reapers. That much is certain. To that end, several dry dock ships are ready to help build the Crucible. Garrus will coordinate them. Yes, sir. And when the time comes to deploy it, the full measure of our fleet will be there for Earth. May the spirits watch over us all. I'll start managing Turian support right away, Shepard. You must be exhausted. Morden dying... it can't be easy. I'll sleep when I'm dead. We both know you need a clear head to win a war. There's no room for mistakes here. You should catch some shut-eye. I'll make sure Joker doesn't launch any suicide missions. 
Anything happens, you let me know. open. Shepard, there's something you need to hear. All right. Is this a bad time? It's fine. Tell me what's going on. The Solarian Counselor has an urgent matter. Let me guess. He called the calm room. The Council must be taking the Crucible seriously. I'll see you downstairs. Commander, there is something we should discuss if you are finished rewriting history. I made my decision, Counselor. There's not much anyone can do about it now. Yes. We're going to have billions more Krogan in the galaxy. It's a good thing you saved my life once, Shepard. Otherwise, well, I have concerns about humanity's representative, Counselor Udina. My agents have discovered that he's using his authority to move vast sums of money. For what purpose? We're not sure. Why bring this to me? Put Citadel security on it. You are a human and relatively neutral politically. Your backing would help me ease through... Well, let's not speak of it now. Come to the Citadel and grant me a moment of your time. You may find it interesting. Ballard out. Commander, Admiral Hackett's available on VidCom. Commander Shepard, something you need to talk about? What's our state of readiness, Admiral? The good news is we're managing to win in some sectors. The bad news is we're losing in others. I'm encouraged by our order of battle, though. It seems to be working. We just need to stick to it and pick up the pace. Do you know how the other races are doing against the Reapers? Believe it or not, the Turians and Krogan actually seem to be getting along. Or not Rex has deployed troops and they're giving the Reapers a moment of pause. The Solarians are still hanging on to Sirkesh, but the Reapers are starting to breathe down their necks too. What about the Asari? They have to be feeling the heat. The Reapers are moving fast with the obvious intent of taking Thessia. Interestingly, the Reapers are leaving Parnak alone. It's the Yogg homeworld. Can't say that I blame them. Yogg have teeth. Well, if we lose this war, it might be them running the next cycle. It's easy to forget the Reapers don't destroy every species. Just the ones who can threaten them. Any word on the Volus and Elcor? 
The Turians and the Krogan sent forces to the Volus homeworld, Irun. It might not be enough, but at least they've got Reaper forces bogged down in a nasty ground war. As for Elcor, they're still in the fight, though our projections show the Reapers encroaching on their territory soon. What happened to the Batarians? Never stood a chance, hit by the Reapers straight out of the gate. And without any allies to call on, I think the Batarians are history. Have we heard anything from the Quarians or Geth? Something might be brewing near the Geth border, but our intel is sketchy. News is getting harder to come by as things get worse. Nothing more, sir. Keep me posted. Hack it out. Alright. So. Kind of hit a big milestone in the story here. Bethany, you see the bids of the Maw taking down the Reaper? Man, I wish I could have been there. I'm just glad the diplomats are off the ship. A Krogan and a Turian in the same room is a fight waiting to happen. Commander, Admiral Hackett has requested your help with a Cerberus fighter base on Navaria. Alright, well, I guess we got a Cerberus base to take care of, but, uh,. Let's go, uh, chat with, uh, Javik and, yeah, Javik and James. I don't know why I can't talk right now. Genophage here, huh? This beats the hell out of reporting on the Milgram City Council. I don't think I've heard of Milgram. Which planet is that again? Reckenstein. It's right next door to the Citadel. I'm a colony kid. Good for you. All right. I'm sure Javik has a lot to say, considering he was just involved in a ground fight against a Reaper, and came out the other end. Commander. You settling in, Javik? I believe some of the crew wishes to be my friend. That is not my purpose here. Also, I find I need to wash my hands. The residue of the ship is strong. How so? I have been exploring. There are traces of those who lived on the Normandy before. I detected a human female. Her genetic structure was unnatural, as if artificially created. Sounds like Miranda. And the Krogan we met, who lived in these quarters. He was undergoing a metamorphosis. His memories were confused, not organic to his mind. There was great confusion and turmoil. I still can't wrap my head around that. Reading information like you do. For my people, it was as natural as breathing. Evolution's an amazing force. Our scientists believed it was the only force in the galaxy that mattered. They called it the cosmic imperative. The strong flourished. The weak perished. The governments of your cycle seem concerned with ensuring the survival of all. Was this imperative just your scientists' opinion, or did they prove something we don't know? The universe had already proven it. They only had to look around. And saw what, exactly? Extinction is the rule of law in the cosmos. The natural order of things. The weakest species are doomed. We can't afford any weak links in this war. They drain our resources. They can become a resource of their own. How? If the Reapers are busy conquering the weak, they are not watching you. So use them as a distraction. All strategies must be considered, and few are too extreme. Though I do not think your Asari approves of my beliefs. Liara? I think she just had a different idea about what Protheans were like. We are all a product of our time. Had I been born in this cycle, perhaps I would be the noble scholar she wishes me to be. You think you'd like that? It's a whole different line of work. I wouldn't know. Living a life of constant war. Taking life in every battle. I see how it could be tough to see outside the box. It is the only box I have known. It shapes me. A stone is shaped by the one who carves it. This stone has no choice in the form it will take. You and I, Commander. War is our sculptor. And we are prisoners to its design. 
Maybe not much longer. We win this and we'll both be set free. Hmm. Had yeah, some interesting talking points there, definitely. By the way, before I head down, I probably should make sure... Yep, okay, James is still downstairs. Cool. That's good. You think that cure they dispersed could do anything to us? We're not going to start growing scales or anything, right? Maybe now that we have the Krogan on board, we can go back to fighting the Reapers. I was looking at the specs on that Reaper you took out on Tachanka. That was one of the small ones? Don't get me wrong, it's still dead, but damn. There was nothing small about it. Too bad about Tarquin. I was starting to like him. Hey. Alright, well, not as much uh, interesting thing to say as... Uh Hmm, pardon me. Java CAD, but eh, whatever. Alright, so tune in next time. I think we're going to go handle that Cerberus base that, uh, what's her name there? Trainor mentioned. Anyway, until then, as always, later, folks.